Helene just became a Category 1 hurricane rapidly, strengthening in the Caribbean Sea. It is moving north along Mexico's coast toward the U.S. with sustained winds of 80 miles an hour. It's been prompting residents to evacuate, schools to close, officials to declare emergencies across Florida and Georgia. Heavy rainfall is expected with a life-threatening storm surge. Helene is expected again to become a major category, if not three or higher, by tomorrow when it reaches Florida's Gulf Coast. Now, coincidentally, our our own focus reporter John Charlton's in Longboat Key near Sarasota, Florida, celebrating what was supposed to be a wedding anniversary. But John, you're packing up. Yeah, you can, yeah, you can say that, Brooke. Uh, mandatory evacuation issued for uh, this part of Sarasota County and Manatee County. We're on Longboat Key uh, on the Gulf side, of course. Uh, this is actually the second time in three years that we've had to evacuate from here. Uh, because of a hurricane. The first one was Ian, where we evacuated to um, Naples because it was outside the cone. And then once we got to the hotel in Naples, the hurricane shifted and we were inside the cone. Of course, it devastated Sanibel and Fort Myers. But let me give you a, a look at the beach right now. You can see the water uh, is it's turning up pretty good. Um, yesterday at times it was like glass out here. So obviously the winds are kicking up and the surf is getting rougher. We didn't see very many people on the beach today, uh, but there is one lady out there laying out, uh, reading a book or something, and a couple other people walking up and down the beach. It's not supposed to hit here until uh, overnight Wednesday, uh, today overnight, and into Thursday. So we have plenty of time to evacuate, but we definitely want to get off this island uh, before they decide to shut the water off and close the two bridges, uh, allowing people in and out or on and off of this island. Brooke. Are you trying to fly back out today? No, um, we are going to Fort Myers. We have a friend that has a condo there and have invited us to stay there for a couple days to see if we can possibly uh, ride this out from down there. and. If we're lucky, it doesn't really affect this area and we can finish out our vacation here on Longbow Key. I think you should just stay home next time for the, for the anniversary. <laughs> well, our digital manager, manager Jay Scamma, said uh, next year go to Duluth. So <laughs> I think uh, that would be safer uh, against a hurricane. It might be already snowing in Duluth at this point of the year, but who knows? I love how you're wearing the sungra sunglasses because, you know, there's so much sunshine right now. <laughs> Well, you know, the the, sun, the sand here is, is awfully white, so there up. is a glare. So <laughs> I'm just going to put my sunglasses back on and, uh, you know, um, just enjoy the view as long as I can before we have to leave. All right, you and many others. John, get home safe. Thanks so much for tuning in. Uh, during your vacation, Hurricane Helene is forecast to hit Florida's Big Bend again by tomorrow night. We'll keep you updated.